I'm Albert Wiegman, pediatric cardiologist from the Academic Medical Center in Amsterdam, the Netherlands, and um, involved in familial hypercholesterolemia for uh, already 23 years, seeing many children with familial hypercholesterolemia. And when they enter my outpatient ward, I congratulate them that they will become 100 because the uh, diagnosis is made early and the fact is that uh, atherosclerosis starts with arthrosis and arthrosis can be removed, the fat can be removed out of the vessel wall. When it's sclerosis, it's stuck in the vessel wall, it's calcified and in young people it's just fat and uh, we saw uh, um, in a group compared with those with placebo that um, they had already thicker walls than their unaffected siblings. But if we treat with uh, statin or other types of drugs, but especially at the moment with statins, we see the wall becoming thinner. So that's promising. Um, and nowadays we know for uh, because of the long term follow up, some children started at the age of 17 in 1993 and are now already 38 and still alive and kicking um, whereas their parents died at a much earlier uh, age perhaps in between uh, 23 and 38 um, that they have still clean vessels and that's the uh, the goal we go, are aiming for. And we do it with uh, rather weak statins in rather low dose. So the benefit is if they start at an early age, especially before puberty, it becomes incorporated in their lifestyle. It becomes from, from them. And uh, they adhere the taking of the drugs, they adhere the lifestyle of non-smoking, they adhere the lifestyle of um, exercising and they adhere the lifestyle of good food, uh, vegetables and fruit and not too fatty uh, diet and then it makes it easy for them. They feel comfortable by knowing how to act on this disorder. And hopefully it never becomes a disease and that's our aim uh, for the coming hundred years of their life.